Hey, this is Kevin. I'll make this quick. I just launched a brand new course called Build an AI Chatbot with Python. In this course, you'll create your first AI app in 60 minutes using Langchain and Langgraph. In this video, I'll tell you about Langchain and Langgraph, as well as how you can access LLMs for free via API. If you like what you hear, please check out the course. It's only $9 and the link is in the description below. Thanks. In this course, you'll build a custom chatbot using an LLM, Langchain, and Langgraph. Let me explain each of these terms. LLM is short for Large Language Model. You've almost certainly used an LLM like GPT-4, Gemini, Llama, or Claude, probably through a chat-based interface. These models are known as foundation models because they are very large scale and serve as the foundation for a wide variety of downstream tasks. They're trained on vast data sets and designed to be general purpose, meaning they can be used as is or adapted for specific applications. Langchain is a framework for developing applications powered by LLMs. For example, if you wanted to build a customer service bot for your company on top of GPT-4, you could use Langchain. Langgraph is an extension of Langchain that allows you to build more complex workflows for your application. You can build complex workflows using Langchain alone, but adding on Langgraph makes certain aspects of app development way easier, which is why we're going to use both in this course. Langchain and Langgraph are both free, open source Python libraries. Their development and direction are guided by a for-profit company called Langchain, which also offers some paid features for debugging and deployment. Our use of Langchain and Langgraph will be 100% free, and there are also some LLMs that you can use for free. As I said, we'll be building an app on top of an LLM using Langchain and Langgraph. One of the benefits of the Langchain framework is that you can use any LLM you want. We'll be writing code to tell Langchain and Langgraph what to do, and it will communicate with the LLM of your choice using API requests. Most LLM options are paid, but a few options are free. If you have a credit card and can afford spending a few dollars, I recommend using a model from OpenAI who are the makers of ChatGPT. At the moment, I'd recommend using GPT-40 Mini, which is fast, cheap, and high quality. Pricing is based on the number of input and output tokens you use. GPT-40 Mini currently costs 15 cents per million input tokens plus 60 cents per million output tokens. Using OpenAI's tokenizer, we can see how tokens are used to represent words. By copying and pasting this text, we can see that most words and punctuation marks become their own tokens, whereas some words like tokenization and OpenAI are split into multiple tokens. For fun, we can see the IDs of each token. Anyway, the point is that you'll be charged based on how many tokens you send to the model and how many tokens it sends back. If you don't have a credit card or you don't want to spend anything, this page has free options. My current recommendation from here is Mistral La Platform because it's completely free and has very high token limits. The main downside is that they're allowed to use any data you send to them to improve their model. 
In other words, your data does not remain private to you. Also, their free plan is a bit slower than GPT-40 Mini, and the results aren't quite as good, but that is fine while you're learning. Once you need your data to be private, you can switch to a paid option. And by then, you'll have a good understanding of how many tokens you're using, so you can estimate the cost of switching to a paid model. If you like what you hear, please check out the course. It's only $9, and the link is in the description below. Thanks.